guys, I just wanted to share this Halloween album that I made. It is a snap album and it feels like burlap. It's fabric. I love it. And I wanted a way to document all of my kids' Halloween costumes from the time that they were little. And this is just a fun thing to have laid out during Halloween so that my kids can look through their costumes and it's just, you know, a fun thing. So. I added one of the papers that came with the album, it, and I like that it shows through to the whatever's behind it, and I bought some of this from the Dollar Tree and just put it on there. Uh, these are um, spider stickers, and then this is wood veneer stickers from the Target Dollar Spot this year. Um, and then I just filled it in with pocket pages. I did cover all of my journaling um, because it has places and stuff like that. So. I used a Dymo label maker to, um, oh, sorry, I don't know what the best way is to do this. Um, I used a Dymo label maker to do the year on every page. And um, and then I, put, I did pictures of my kids. So this was my oldest daughter's first Halloween. And I did a journaling card and I left this, um, there, and this can move around. I just need to seal this pocket. And this is 2008. She was Little Red Riding Hood. And this is us. And then I added some of the 4x6 Project Life cards into the middle for journaling and decoration or to add extra pictures if I want later. Uh, this is a 31 card. And some of these are from Studio Calico kits that I've had forever. And some of them are papers. This is a paper that I got from Tuesday morning, a little six by six pad. And then I just added this into there to, you know, give a spooky kind of fun effect. And then I did more pictures and journaling, 2010, 2011. Um, I tried to use different pages, but a lot of my pictures are wallet sized. And I did some rub-ons right there. Um, this is a rub-on. I actually made this costume for her. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, I made that costume for her. I did another four by six card so I can put a picture here if I want later. And it has journaling on the other side. I made this costume for her as well. This pad is so cute, I don't remember what it is. Maybe I can post it in the description. And then I did, I made this costume as well. She wanted to be Jim from Jim and the Holograms and there was no way I was finding that costume. So I made it and we bought the wig. It was an adult wig, so it was huge on her, but um, she won a costume, I think like funkiest costume or craziest costume or something that year. And then I made her um, doctor's coat and her little leggings for Doc McStuffins. Everything else was from like the thrift store, but I made the coat and the leggings. I made everything but the tights on here and the shoes. I did the dress and the belt. And then this, and then this is like my favorite picture of them. I took that picture myself and I love it. It's so cute. Um, I made her costume. She wore a leotard and then I made her tutu. I wish you could see the back because it did like the fountainy thing in the back. And I made her mask. Um, she wanted to be a flamingo and all the flamingo costumes I didn't find very cute. So I made my own. Um, we pieced hers together at the thrift store. And it says, the power of imagination makes us infinite. And then journaling. I had a shaker pocket that I needed to seal. And then I prepped this page for this year's photos that I need to add. And then I have extras in here. This has um, extra papers and stickers and stuff in it that I can use for additional years. It's a um, little pocket, it's super cute. And I think I just ordered that on Amazon. I don't remember. But anyways, yeah, super cute album. Thank you for watching, bye.